Today's lesson is all about repairing glass doors. I'm going around my house and my children have smashed the glass doors. So I'm moving, so before I move, I've got to repair all these glasses. So there you can see there's glass in those ones and those two, I've already smashed them out. Now, here's another door and down the bottom. I smashed it out and then I thought, you know what? I should have been recording this. So I'm sorry you missed the fact that I smashed the glasses out, but this is what I'm doing now. So here we have, you can see the glass is still on the floor. Now what I've done is I've smashed the glasses out and what I've got to do now, oh, oh, first I wore protected gloves and I've taken my gloves off my right hand so that I can video this. But from the other side, you've got to find out which one of these beads to pull out. And in this case, the beads were being put on the inside of the door. So after I smashed the glass out, I shut the door and I went to the other side and I wedged these out. Now, there are nails, little baby nails in them. So you have to be careful not to snap this because what I do is I put this back in or buy new ones. Now here, you can see an obstruction right there. That's where the nails are. So what I'm doing now is I'm going through this and take the beads out carefully because I want to use it again. And then I tidied it up, tidied it up here by taking out all the dirty potty that was in there. And let me show you one that I've already done. On this door here, You can see all the mess for the potty that was there before. So after taking the glass out, you take off the beads and then you go and you clean as much of this mess off as possible. Scrape it down nice and smooth. You don't have to do it perfect because you're gonna put more potties on it, but just get it nice and smooth. And that's what I've done for both frames. Now I've done three already downstairs because my husband smashed those ones. Let's go downstairs. Now yesterday, as you can see, this door, this one, this one, and this one got smashed yesterday. So I've replaced all three because he slammed the door. Drop to your own conclusion. So here now, inside, you can see what I've done is before I took it off, each one of them, because it's three of them, what I did is I marked the beads. And this bead, it says bottom, middle. The top one says top, middle. And on the side beads, I put top of the bead and bottom of the bead. Now, because I had three glasses and I want them to go back into each other, what I did is at the top one, I marked number one, two, and three. So this was right number one, this one is right number three, and this one is right number, no, right number one, right number two, and right number three, and so on, all the way around, so that I put the frames back where I got them from. So as you can see, this door that I've done is finished and done. New glass, and this cost me only the cost of the glass. When I say me, actually it wasn't me, it cost my husband because he broke it. So what I did is I went out and bought it. The glass for all of this came up to 33 pound. And then I bought myself some dresses and outfit to wear tonight because we're going out and um, building for it and told him that was the cost of my labor for replacing these glass. So women, get something out of it. 
yeah, DIY, which is what we are, uh, and free labor, but not this time. He broke it, he paid for it. <laughs> so now I'm gonna put the glass back in. Here are the little beads, the little nails. That I've got to pull each one of them out. I bought some new ones to put in it. So you get yourself a tweezer and you pull these these things out. It's still stuck on it. It's there on the gloves. broke inside but you just go around and take them all out. Here's one I'll get out. I'll get this one out. And pull it out. There you go. So you just gotta take those out. And when you put the beads back in you put new ones in. That double secure. So I'm gonna go around now all the excess glass. Now you've got to be gentle because you don't want to cut yourself. So that's what I'm doing. It's very difficult for me to do this and hold the camera at the same time. But this is just a quick demonstration showing you how I've done it. So I've got one of these. I've got a large one and a small one. Be delicate. And now and I'm going to go all the way around and tidy up all the edges, smooth it all out, and then get it ready, and then put the potty on, and get ready. I am now using some putty, putty, P-U-T-T-Y, uh, multi-purpose, and what I do is, I'm protecting my hand because it really does make a little mess, and what we do is I, I roll it, a little bit too much here, roll it and I get just a little worm and I apply it to the window frame. Now I'm working from this side and pressing but I'll show you the other side in a sec and I'll press it on the frame where I'm going to put the window in. Now um, I advise you to leave just a little bit putty sticking out this way to help so that when you finish the finishing touch of it you can scrape that off and tidy it all up. But uh, this is what I'm doing. And I'll show you the other side. So I've done this there and I've done here. And just roll it out. Nice little worm. And apply it. Now I do this very gentle because I've scraped off all the glass, but you never know. A bit might be there so you just do this gentle just in case there is some glass but you should clean that off nice and clean so you don't hurt yourself so I'm working from the outside in and you can choose which way you want to do it Now, this is my son's room, and I told him to do this, but as I can hear downstairs, he's playing the piano while his mother fixes his, his door for him. And I encourage you women to train up your children how you want them to end up, and that's to be a man, and do this instead of me doing it. Right, so here's the window, the frame. Now, I'm going to go and get the glass, which I had cut for me earlier. Here we are, here's the glass. And this particular glass, he isn't giving me the right one, but it'll do. This side is kind of straight, and this side is bumpy. So I'm going to put the bumpy side on the outside. So we're going to come inside and see. I'm going to, oh, before I put the glass in, come, come inside a minute. 
oh be careful of the glass and just look at the bottom and you can see the putty on the inside all the way around and what I try to do is make sure that it goes to the edge here otherwise when I finish I've got to fill it with more putty but that's something we have to do so now I put the glass in and squeeze it gently onto the patty. Now, when I took the measurements for these glass, what I did is I measured from the outs the frame to the frame, this there measurement, and this measurement was I think it was uh, 29 centimeters across and 33 centimeters going down. And when I measured it, I went to the shop and I told them the measurement and he, he deducted uh, and made it smaller to fit in. So I left that to him. So if anybody got it wrong, it would have been him. And that's it. Put the glass in and then you get some nails. No. And then we get these things. The frames that I took. Now this is going to be a little bit tight putting it back in. Right, now as I said, downstairs I marked each one, but this one I didn't. So I'll fly by the pads. So, which might be a mistake, so let's put that at the bottom. I'm gonna do that last. And then this one up the top. Put it back in. You find as well that this is where it's going to be a tight fit. So what I do is I leave this bit out hanging, put this one in at the top, squash it in, and then I fight to put this in because it's like it's almost like it's expanded, but it is it ha it probably has. So what I do is I put this last square this last one in. As you can see, it looks like it doesn't fit. But what I do now is I get my hammer and I gently hammer it in. So squeeze it in. There we go, it's, it's going in. Just gently squeeze the whole lot in. And guess what? Try not to break the glass. <laughs> Otherwise, you have to start all over again. Uh -huh. Yeah. Here comes my son, who this room belongs to, wondering what am I doing? Fixing his glass that he broke. He said he doesn't know how it broke, but it's broken. So anyway, I'm only gonna gently take this and tap it in. I'm not gonna try and mark it. Do you wanna come in? Come, come in. The man behind the messy room. Hiya. So, and basically, that is it. Oh, I'll tell you what, Lewis, just go back outside for me. Oh, yeah. Inside Francesca's room, on the, ch the chest of drawer that's there, you see a bag of nails. Just take six out, eight out for me. Little small nails. I must say, women, try not to be afraid of getting your hands dirty. The thing is already broken, so you can't, whatever it is you're repairing, don't worry about it. It's already broken, so you can't do anything worse. You can only but try to fix it. And if you can't fix it, get the professionals in. And in, until then, you become the professional and fix your house. Have you got it, Lewis? I don't know it is. It's a plastic bag. The putty is um, coming out. All you do is take something and just clean it off. Uh, and that's from the other side. We're gonna, I'm going to go back to the other side and I'm just going to clean it off and straighten it up and tidy it up. 
and that's that. And that's how you change your broken glass. Don't be afraid of anything. Wow. Yeah. It's not there either. I'll just look in my bedroom, see if you see something like to that is description. Believe you and me, ladies, it's as easy as baking a pie. Don't be afraid of doing certain jobs yourself. If you wait on your husband, you'll be waiting until you're a pensioner. And that's when he's got time. So remember I'm telling you about these little nails. Right, here are these little nails. They look like they are just over, uh, over half an inch just so you gently you have to make sure that you don't smash the glass when you do it so you don't put it in at an angle to get the glass I put them straight down because all I want to do is go into the wood so I put it straight down and I've got this other tool which is downstairs I'm gonna to have to get that later which you can push it in further you put it on top of it and then you hit it and it goes in further. So that's what I've got to do afterward later on. But here are all the holes before. That, that's a job done. This glass ain't coming back out. Again, falling out or anything. And basically you go around doing all of, all of them the same way. And that's, and that's that done. And then give it a paint afterward and freshen it up and that's it. Yeah? Lewis. Oh, Dave is You're gonna have to wait. You're gonna have to wait. Dave, I'll phone you! You know what I just realised? Mum's all proper fix up all the glasses and we're moving. That's why I'm doing it. Yeah, Dave, yeah! Because you've got to give, leave the house in a good condition. In the. Oh, up here! Go outside the front, I'll chuck it to you! Go outside the front, I'll chuck oh, it to your you. Your voice is annoying. That's... Okay, so that's the window done. So that's the window done. Um, and I've got the other two as you see. So as you can see, the full the full window is now done. Um, and that's it. Right, so here we have it. Yes, you have to excuse the mess. But when you see builders, you don't see them looking at their best now, do you? <laughs> You'll see me later. I'm going out in five minutes, I'm late. But now, I've finished the job, and as you can see, the glass is now in, and all I've got to do is just paint it. All right, so these, these two are the glass, so paint it and clean it around the other side as well. The other side is done. So, as I said, <sighs> man power. <laughs> Here, done another job. Women, if you can get your husband to do the job, get them to do it. If not, as I said, don't wait until you're old <laughs> and unable to do it and have to pay a, a lot of money to get somebody else to do it. It's very easy to do, I've done it. This job really took me two days because it was six glasses I did and being all serious now. Uh, six glasses, so cut it out, clean it, clean up the mess, clean up the glass and everything. Relax in the meantime, have dinner, come back another day and finish off the job. Uh, it didn't take that long really, so you can all be done in one day. The only thing it does, it really does do it to your nails, that potty. Uh, even though I had the glo gloves on, it got into it. But that's it, another job done. Have fun, and woman power. <laughs>